So lately I was wondering, why does a cat's eye look like that? Why does it have those weird slit pupils instead of just round like ours? I decided to build a special camera lens so we can see what cats see through those eyes that they have. These are all the parts you will need, and I will put some links in the description. This is a very easy project you can build yourself in just a few minutes. Before we try this out, I found an article that was written by some scientists at UC Berkeley and Durham University. They found out something I wasn't expecting. The shape of the pupil relates to the ecology of the animal. Animals that have the vertical slit pupil like cats, they're usually predators and low to the ground. It's supposed to help them detect low horizontal movements like a mouse scampering along the ground. Larger predators, including the larger cat species, actually have round pupils like us. Grazing animals often have a horizontal slit pupil. It helps them see horizontal lines like when they're running on flat ground. It can also reduce glare from the sun. And for some reason the mongoose has this too, even though it's sort of like a cat. Now let's see what things look like through the eye of a cat. First of all, this is a cheap uh, single element lens, so everything around the outside is going to be blurry. Our eyes are like that too, but most of the retina cells are crowded in the middle anyway, so we don't even notice. That area of sharp resolution is called the fovea, and cats have something like a fovea too, but it's spread out horizontally to give them wider vision along the ground. Apart from that, things that are in focus look pretty much normal, but where things are out of focus, that is where the pupil shape has its effect. In these pictures, the background is out of focus, and you can see a vertical blur caused by the shape of the pupil. Here the fence is out of focus and the vertical wires stand out more clearly than the horizontal wires. This is what you see with a round pupil. The vertical blur exposes more cells in the retina to any horizontal movement. The cat can easily spot these horizontal movements in the background and then focus in on the target. That blurry background can also simplify what the cat is seeing and hide unnecessary details. This is like that portrait feature you might have on your phone, which makes the background blurry so people can't see your messy room. Now what about those animals with a horizontal pupil? With this setup, horizontal lines really stand out. Look at how sharply defined the shadows are in the road there. If there was a snake lying there, it would really jump out at you. One more thing is that cats can't see color very well. Humans have three types of color sensitive cells in the retina corresponding to red, green, and blue. All the colors we see are a combination of those three colors. Cats, on the other hand, only have two of those cell types. One is sensitive to yellow-green light and the other is sensitive to blue. So the cat's color vision might look something like this. Birds, on the other hand, can see more colors that we can't even see. Maybe you can already imagine what that would be like, but be sure to check out my video on bird vision.